while we are here sitting so primly talking about why the president used back to channel no this time around is a collective fight this time around irrespective of your political party irrespective of an individual you find yourself around it is quite pulling about this time as a patriot citizen as a citizen that want to see this country to move forward it is time to call a clearer call to support the executive and no exception i believe in my opinion as an activist that there was some bad channel but it is now harmful bad channel the executive did what they could they, 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 they think in the opinion at this point in time to bring development to this country and if do you think the executive proceed rightly i proceed rightly and not proceed rightly is not the cause but achieving what the executive went for it is what i'm here what do you want advocating what do i want yeah i am appealing to the 55th national legislature most importantly most importantly speaker fanatic kofa to agree to operate collaborate with the executive decision on the ongoing negotiation about this zero machine as i speak with you now every communities every towns every district citizens that live there want to see this zero machine start to work on the road can you imagine if at all the executive put a full stop if at all i mean the legislature put a full stop to this yellow machine do you know the reaction of our citizens in great Kema county the legislature are coming is, mm -hmm. yeah, are I, coming I, I just want to jump in. do you know the reaction of our citizens in great Kema county do you know the reaction of our citizens in great Jida? our citizens in Babaru county maryland sando grand Jida, bomi bon most of all and other places it will be a volcanic eruption that will unstabilize this place here in less than 42 hours if there's if the legislature do not affect the signature to concoin with the executive when the time reach for us to concur with them on the yellow machine saga. some members of the, the legislature specifically the house of representatives have said the president violated the constitution of liberia that talks about how uh, as, uh, Article 34 D that talks about how uh, agreement or shares are reached. Uh, that is, according to them, is impeachable. What do you make of that? Impeachable what? Violation of the law. Let me tell you something. That's, that's, what, the what, I said, that's, what, the that's what I said previously. Mm -hmm. The president's decision, it is a harmful decision. No! It is not a harmful decision. Didn't he violate the law? There are some decisions that you made are harmful and there are some decisions that you made are not harmful violation of the are constitution coming. is not harmful are is that coming. what you're saying are you are coming. that the violation of the constitution is not harmful uh, it's not a harmful decision because at the common goods males of Liberian are going to benefit uh, from a farm to market role from a, 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 a market role to farm role and to community role and to 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 the major highway that will be constructed if this yellow machine saga is passed imagine imagine i'm, I'm coming it is because that many of Liberia is going to benefit from the yellow machine so the violation of the president was not in no way in error nobody is saying that in fact the violation of the president a large violation because I'll say a large because uh, the law himself gave the president the authority to, to, to carry on uh, 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 some negotiation. And if the negotiation will be finalized, it is the lawmaker here uh, will carry on the finalization of this negotiation. That's why, if you were to look at the key word that was uh, uh, enshrined in the president's uh, statement that was read by Fanatic Kofa. Key word there is ongoing negotiation. Everything has not been finalized. The president has said to us, it is a friend who has planned to give us this machine because his friend who knows President Waka have all of those interests in President Waka and believe that in fact their red journal must be prioritized to the fullest and their red journal must have a fluation on the new President Waka says here. As an 
independent activists that are no political have supported a uh, Joel Imam Waka or any other politician from that viewer, it is incumbent onto me to look at the greater good of the citizens across the country. And I can simply say to you, if you take your camera, if you take your video, if you take any other uh, uh, electronic gadget you have now, and then reach out to those people in Spain, Bokondire, Kampwe, Tabeta, Salala, Kemes, Bread, Bento, go and ask them whether this decision that was made by His Excellency President Johnny Mambaka, what is a harmful decision or not? They will clearly say to you, it is not a harmful decision because that decision is going to directly affect the life of many of the viewers across the global political lens of our country. So, the main argument here is, is the decision that was taken by the President, harmful decision? No. It so, was so the it. President, was so, the President right? I would say no too. But as the decision of the president is a harmful decision, no. It is not a harmful decision. Although there are some losses, nobody is perfect. But for the greater good of this country, for a core that sends this country 1847, one of Africa's oldest republic, it is about time that we put aside all of those mirage. All of those days that black were all of those and look for the forward good of the very of Somebody our watching, somebody watching say you've been paid to do what you been mean. Paid? You've been paid. You they give you something called food money. <laughs> How do you respond to that? Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. People in the problem of Liberia knows activists like they really. At no point in time, a single individual can put their hands on and say. I pay Macaulay Ronald to do a advocate. But if the person pay me now to do the advocate now, then it mean that uh, that place you have been filled with, with men and women and I will come here and black all year to measure that in fact they can get a revenue attention. Yeah. No. All of my protests have been done on the basis of conviction. How long, how long do you intend? Country. How long do you intend to, to I, carry I this? I stopped here last night. I'm going to the last time you were here, you were dragged. I'm, uh, Maybe somebody will come move here again. Uh, dragged? The last time you were here, I saw uh, somebody. I'm not deterred by that. Mm -hmm. Dragging me all a year, beating me all a year. It is time my worry. That's why I'm saying here yet that in fact, I'm here to appeal to the conscience of the 55th National Legislature to buy in this argument of an independent activist that about this time, we should not politicize. This Yaren Martin Saka wholly and surely rests on the shoulder and on the head. Do you think of the president, do you think the president needs country? to apologize to the legislature for wrongly proceeding? Apologize to the legislature for wrongly proceeding? I don't see that as a wrongly proceeding. I don't as an independent activist. I see that as an ongoing negotiation that has not reached the legislature because let me tell you something. I gave you a place study. The machine, the machine is, is already I, I gave you a place study. I gave you a place study. If you walk to uh, a car, a car uh, dealer place, the car dealer will give you a uh, three month warranty. The three month warranty will be that go and carry the car, use the car for three months. Or serve the car for three months, and if you are satisfied with how the car moves, the manner in which the car moves, the sort of ratio, the brake order, that the air condition, and all other things, uh, return my car back to me in the team where it's in. In the same way, in fact, the president friend have given this yellow machine to 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 to, to support the arrest channel that are never supported. They are supported the arrest channel. No. I have not supported the arrest channel, and at no point in time, I would not support the arrest channel. But I am saying to you, for the greater good of this country, to be where we are to today, it is quite prudent, it is quite necessary, it is not a harmful decision for the president to take on the stand. He talk as a leader. Sometimes you have to make it hard call. Those hard call will be criticized. Those are called what we look at Marcus Topele, but it is equivalent under you as a leader to stay firm and remain consistent finally, and persistent. Finally, Magdalene Runner, as we take leave for you on this, your, your one man protest, I just let her ask this question. Um, even though you are championing the cause for the yellow machines that they spend uh, this cost, but on the overall, how do you see the Joseph Boakai government as, as, as a Liberian citizen who has been? in this uh, political or advocacy as a core aid 
And is it the government? The governance. I know you are the one who put those Kwaka leadership. No. Is that what you call it? I'm not here to discuss. No, I'm not here to discuss. Baka si baka come. No, I'm not here. I'm here. Seeing this machine as a good thing to the Labrum people. Yeah. How do you see Baka government government leadership? Yeah, thank you. That's what I said. I'm not here to discuss the oversight or the overall uh, performance of Baka leadership in less than six months. No. The only reason why you see I came out as an independent activist to give a clear call and a peek to the conscience of our honorable lawmakers vis-a-vis -vis honorable fanatic Kofa is because I believe about that point in time we should be a patriotic citizen. Are you convinced that your call is going to be a hieto? I, am I convinced that my call will be a hieto? Mm -hmm. Yes, because this call is in the rightful interest of every lab. You are the genius standing behind this camera with your conscience in your thoughts, I am challenging you to ask yourself this question. I, the, the book will say, Koloko Kwas. And Koloko Kwas in your mind. And ask yourself and say, What is, uh, what is Koloko Kwas? We, we are coming, talking to yourself. Do we need, do we need this yellow machine? As a citizen, I challenge every one of you here. All of you are from different parts of Liberia. So are you people, Nima, Greku, Lofa, Sano, Grand Gide. Where are you from? Me? I'm from Mosserara County, Grand Bazaar County. As I speak to you now, I, I how is the yellow mountain beneficial to you? As I speak to you now, as I speak to you now, my grandmother today makes her 77 years old. When I went to the Omar uh, last week, the Omar said to me, Makri, uh, I'm 77 years old. I never see a fan to mark a road. I'm 77 years old. They live in my town. I am 77 years old. I now have the opportunity to have a constructed role by any other government. Imagine my grandmother saying that to me. I broke down in tears and said to myself, Mother, grandmother, what do you think of the yellow machine? She said, my son, if the president, if the president decides to negotiate on this yellow machine on good faith, I support it because it is a left achievement for me, a 77 years old, old, old man. Okay, my name, we had a tell you. We had a tell you for you, yeah. Now, say to our mother, mm -hmm. as an activist, we'll do everything possible to make sure, in fact, this government can achieve his erect gender when it comes to the issue of this general machine. I can simply say to you, if you are a citizen in Nima County, do you support the agenda? If you are, eh? do you support the arrest agenda? I am not a supporter of the I am supporting this yellow machine. This yellow machine. I am not supporting the right now. I am not point out supporting any other general purpose. I will know I'm not. I am supporting this yellow machine agenda. For that I believe, in my opinion, will have a total effect on every Liberians. Whether directly, whether indirectly. This yellow machine saga will have a total effect. And I can say to you, if the yellow machine is actualized, you will realize that in fact, the economic sector of our country will boom. The, Do you the, think the government can take care of those machines, can maintain those machines? Oh, yes. I'm so much optimistic and positive that in fact, the government can take care of the machine. Because you know why? You know why? We have a understanding, an engineer, Popular work minister. I believe in my opinion when those yellow machines have been secured and go through all the regular channel, when public work take over it, we have people here to 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 to, to take our own machine. And imagine, imagine that 19 yellow machines will be distributed to 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 to, to, to different counties. How do you think that will, will play out? Right. How do you think? In conclusion. I am asking the honorable speaker. I am here with a letter from 73 youth leaders across the 73 districts in the Republic of Europe. I'm asking the honorable speaker to please send somebody down here so to at least we can give you our letter. We hope our letter will be read in, prim in, 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 in primary today as the independent activists will be here on their honorable family cover. Can serve for us on that honorable family coffin. Can serve for us to present our letter to him. This letter is not intent of violent letter. This letter is to ask 
a big frantic cover to concord with the executive on the Yarrow machine issue. Finally, I asked Eric come here to print some photos and share it around. Then even Major Cove, let the library be aware that our stance on the Yarrow machine, we are not telling Thank you. because we believe that Thank if you. our country must be developed and if program will develop this country, we must look in that direction and support the Yarrow machine soccer. Thank you. 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 As usual, we as journalists, we be curious to follow any bit of the news. So we hear with uh, Macklin Randa. He's an activist, as he call himself. We are here at the grounds of the Capitol building. Today is uh, uh, today is uh, Tuesday, and today is uh, the 16th of July, 2024. It's a regular session day of the legislature uh, when the two house meet in their separate chambers and so the camera is currently focused at the house of representatives where uh michael randall came to with his one man protest and on the other end is the, uh, the wing of the senate the librarian senate you are aware that uh, the issue of the yellow machine been in the corridor it been in uh, discussed at the level of the legislature i'm i'm credibly informed that the, the speaker of the house on yesterday or yesterday rather set up a committee to meet with the president of the republic of liberia to final that uh, discussion on the yellow machine thing i am reliably informed as uh, uh, you know sources in the corridor of the legislature hinted focus on that bro on yesterday that the speaker has set up a committee to meet with the, uh, the president to final our discussion on the yellow machine thing but thanks for following me on this brief uh, 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 interview or uh, with, with McLean we saw him here at the grounds of the capital with, with his placard and as legislative reporters and also the journalists we took a uh, cue in uh, chatting with him uh, my name is Prinks thanks for following but by do join us when we shall have ended the chambers of the House of Representatives to bring you uh, the today's session until them keep following our live broadcast from across the world. We'll bring you uh, on the spot uh, information and news information as they happen. We report then. Bye bye. I'm out.